Okay. <laughs> All right. This story looks really good. Nah, I don't really like that part. Let me just get rid of that. Hey, Shadow. What do you want, Jinx? Can we please go to Popeye's Chicken? Why would you want to go to Popeye's Chicken, Jinx? After the last time you did, did almost destroy the McDonald's that we went to about a while ago. Well, I just thought maybe we could go to Popeye's today because I'm really hungry and was and I'm in the mood for some chicken sandwiches. <sighs> Jinx, look, I'm pretty busy right now writing my story, so can you please, like, at least wait a little longer? Oh, come on, Shadow or Queen of Lions. I want to go to Popeye's. Jinx, look, maybe, maybe if you could wait an hour or so, maybe then I will take you to Popeye's. I want to go now! Jinx, why do you always have to act such a spoiled brat every time you don't get what you want? <sighs> Look, Jinx, I will take you to Popeye's if you promise to behave yourself there. The last time we went there or something like that, you nearly blew up the whole place. So can you please behave yourself for once and not do any more unexpected issues or unexpected outbursts there? <sighs> All right, can we please go to Popeye's? Yes, Jinx, we are going to Popeye's. Just give me a little bit to get ready, and then we'll go from there, okay? Okay. One hour later. All right, Jinx, I'm all ready to go. So, you happy now? Ooh, I cannot wait to go to Popeye's! Now, Jinx, can I explain to you a few things when we go there? Okay, what are they? One... I need you to behave yourself while we're in the, in the restaurant, which means no doing anything nasty. Like, last time we went to a restaurant, you nearly blew up the place. Oh, yeah, I remember that. But I'm sorry, though. And Jinx, I do not want you to cause any trouble at Popeye's, understand? Okay, that's understandable. Good, now let's go. Five minutes later... All right, Jinx, we're at Popeye's. Now, I am going to go through these rules again. All right, what are they, Shadow? Well, Jinx, one thing I'm going to say now is I do not want you to be stealing anybody's food. I don't want you to be stealing anything from this store. I don't want you to be pulling out your guns or weapons or even your powers and shoot at everyone. And most importantly, I want you to behave yourself. Last time we got kicked out of McDonald's because you were not behaving. Okay, okay, that was because I didn't get what I wanted. Jinx, if you don't get what you wanted, you can't be acting like a spoiled brat. Now, let's go inside the restaurant now. All right, Jinx, we're finally inside Popeye's. Now you know the rules, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, welcome to Popeye's. How may I help you? Huh? Wow, hello there. Uh, can I get a, um, I guess you could say a two chicken sandwiches with one with, um, chicken tenders with bone boneless wings with, um, with large fries and a Coke and, and get a spicy chicken sandwich with, um, well, you could definitely say, hey, Papa, we can also get some Coke and even large fries. All right. Will that be here or to go? Uh, it will be for here. Okay. And your name? Uh, the Shadow Lioness or Queen of Lions? Okay. Now, that would be around twenty twenty four fifty. Would that be cash or credit? Or card? Uh, card. Here you go. Beep. There we go. All right. You can eat now. <laughs> all right, Jinx. We got our food a tray and we got it. Oh, boy. I cannot wait to eat all of this. Why did you ask for a spicy chicken sandwich, though, Jinx? Oh, because I was in a spicy mood. That's because. That's why. Jinx, I hope you're not going to have a diarrhea dump or anything like that. Or explode this place not like Patrick did. I still remember Shadow telling me about the time Patrick had an explosive diarrhea and blew up Popeyes. Not to mention the time where Shrek ended up being a spicy, ch spicy chicken sandwich and had diarrhea all over Space Voyager's trash can. And not to mention he even got on the dishwasher. Oh, don't worry. None of this is going to happen. Oh, it can handle spicy stuff. Okay, Jinx. But this time, if you do end up having diarrhea, please go to the bathroom. Of course I will. I am I know it's ladylike to do that, so yeah. All right. few minutes later. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was pretty good. 
Yeah, Jinx, mine wasn't so bad. Uh, can I, um, go outside for a bit? I need some air. Okay, Jinx, why don't you go do that? Okay. <laughs> well, now that I'm outside, what should I do? Hmm, I wonder. Oh, I got spray paint. I am going to spray paint the back of Popeye's. Luckily, nobody's around. I'm going to spray, I'm going to use this spray paint and put graffiti on it. But what should I put? I know, I'll spray paint the F word on it. <laughs> this is going to show the Queen of Lions on what happens when she doesn't bring me my ice cream from McDonald's. <laughs> this is going to be best. Few moments later. <laughs> Jinx, I have been waiting in there for a while and I just finished and I was wondering what. What the hell? Oh, hi, Queen of Lions. I was just, um. Jinx, you, you spray painted the back of Popeyes. Why did you do that? Oh, it's just because you didn't bring me ice cream. So that's why I had to do this. Because you wouldn't let me. Oh, Jinx. I told you not to cause trouble, and now you're going to get kick us kicked out. Why are you doing this, Jinx? Just why? Why do you have to sit there and cause trouble everywhere I take you? Well, you need to bring me my ice cream. <sighs> Jinx, you are such a troublemaker. I don't know why anyone would even put up with your antics. Oh, come on, Queen of Lions. That's just only a little, well, a little prank, I guess you could say. <sighs> Jinx, look, I am going to ask you this. What, you need to get rid of this graffiti on there or else I am going to take you home. No, I don't want to go home. Well, too bad, Jinx. You are, that's what you get for what doing what you did. Now come with me. So, clear this mess up now. But can't I? No. Clean it up now, Jinx, or I won't hesitate to go in and tell the Popeye's custodians of what you did and you're gonna get in big trouble all right all right i'll just get some paint remover and just remove the paint back at home <sighs> jinx i can't believe what you just sit there and did you went inside popeyes and you even went as far as spray painted the f word behind it oh come on i was just only playing a prank jinx that was not funny you know that that could get you in serious trouble if you do spray painting Plus, anybody could have caught you and called the police on you for that. Eh, can we go to Popeye's again? Seriously, Jinx? After what you did? No, I'm not taking you to Popeye's. But can I? I said no! Okay, okay. Now for that, Jinx, you are not getting any Popeye's for the rest of this month. I am tired of what you just did, and this is the worst thing you have ever done. So, Jinx, go to your room, or I'm going to drag your ass up there. <sighs> I don't want to. That's it. I didn't want to do this. But, but, hey, hey, put me down. Too bad, Jinx. This is what you get after what you did at Popeye's. I'm not very happy with what you did, but I didn't. Too bad, Jinx. Hey, what the? <sighs> hey, Shadow, let me out. Well, Jinx, that is too bad. You actually caused trouble. So, I don't trust you. Ah, uh, come on. I really want to go out and go to Popeye's. Jinx, any more complaining and you're going to be stuck in there for a lot longer than you expected. <sighs> well, that Jinx. Ah, Jinx, what did you do? I am escaping to go to Popeye's. Jinx, may I mind you about what you did was not cool. So, here's my answer. No, you are not going to Popeye's. So, with that said, I am banning you from going to Popeye's for the rest of this month after what you did. That is no fair. Hm. Well, too bad, Jinx. So stay in your bedroom, or I won't hesitate to lock you in the basement like Shadow and Boris do to Patrick. Oh, come on, give me a break.